Hello, in today's two minute feature overview, I'm going to highlight the new capabilities that are part of our web application and API security module as part of our January 2021 launch. The capabilities I'm highlighting build on our initial capabilities we announced as part of our Prisma Cloud 2.0 launch. Within Prisma Cloud, you'll see that Prisma Cloud automatically identifies any hosts, containers, or serverless functions that are web applications and their current protection status, alerting the user to any unprotected web applications via our radar view. For some of our new features, we would navigate over to the Web App and API Security tab within the Defend menu. Here, we're able to configure all of the various protections and customize them to each individual application or entity. Here, we can set an app definition to enable endpoint protection or customizable API protection. And you'll see the features that we announced in our Prisma Cloud 2.0 launch. Here, you can customize protection for the OWASP top 10 across many different settings here. Additionally, you can configure access control across network, HTTP headers, and file upload protection, all that can be customized. This brings me to two new additions, bot protection and advanced DOS protection. With bot protection, you're able to customize how Prisma Cloud Web App and API security addresses known bots, unknown bots, implements active bot protection that can be customized, as well as add user-defined bots that you can add via this menu, adding names, header values, and other inbound IP sources for customized bot protection. Additionally, you'll see the op option to enable advanced DOS protection to alert or ban with powerful new capabilities controlling burst rate and average rates, as well as other match conditions or excluded IP lists. And once this protection is enabled, it'll automatically be added to the application wherever you deploy it. At the same time, we've added a new security analytics dashboard for you to investigate audit events next to all the various audits and event criteria that we surface within Prisma Cloud. So here, if I click on Web Automation Tools, I can see any of these audit events and now get a very nice pop-up of all of the information, including audit data, forensic message, attacker information, and HTTP request data, with the ability to even see the raw data that we captured in the event. Thank you very much for watching this two-minute overview, and visit our website to learn more about Web App and API security.